Hey y'all, I was going to make a really quick video on how to turn just about any picture that you like into a 720 by 1280 wallpaper. I'm um, going to kind of talk really fast, but try and keep up. Uh, it's pretty all basic. So for instance, let's say you Google a picture that you like. Here I'm doing couch, living room, wood floors, and you hit search. It's going to come up with web searches, but if you click here on images, then you're going to get pictures, okay? For argument's sake, let's just say that we pick, you know, this picture right here. Now, you want something that's going to be around 720. If you get something that's too small, then when you blow it up for your phone, it's going to look like crap. So the way to find out what the size is, and like I said, you want to start with 720 width, just take a picture that's about that big, hit print screen, open up a paint, and in this case, let's do a new one. Um, oops, okay. So we're gonna hit paste and we're gonna crop it. You go up to crop. Well, first you have to go to select. Then you just go in the corner there and go to about there, hit crop. And then you're gonna go to properties and see how wide it is. All right, it's 675, that's wide enough but you need the height of 1280. So do that, then go, whoops, go select all, drag it down to about there because you want to make the floors bigger. So the way you do that is take your cursor and grab somewhere in the middle, but don't come outside the box or you'll get a white line and then just Stretch that down, and there you go. You got more wood floors. Then you want to do the same for the top so that you have more wall. Just go inside the box and stretch it all the way to the top. And there you are. Now just save it, file, save as. That's the original. I always name everything so it all stays together. That'll be couch one, okay? Then you close and Let's send it to our phone. It's in here. White couch wallpaper. Send to Bluetooth device. And let's see if it works. There it goes. Accept. Oops. So now it should be here, received, and you just take it there, and you see how there's a white line there? So when we go say, set as home screen, you want to try to move that in just a little bit so that you get rid of that white line like that. That should be good. And then you say done and then go home, and there it is. There's my clock, there's some apps. So, I mean, this is not perfect, but that pretty much gives you an idea of how you would do it. Okay, hope that helped everybody. Bye now.